All right, here we go. We're going to Prim. I can fast travel. I'm not walking that. Don't want to do that to you guys. It's precious time I, I could be using to make you guys laugh. Hopefully I'm doing a good job at that. I know that I'm making myself laugh, but... I don't know. I don't know what else I could do. Uh... Uh, oh, I think I need to talk to Nash. There you are. Hey, youngster. Whoa. Still hanging about Prim, huh? Vampire? What's with those eyes? Skinwalker? <laughs> uh. I might know something, but my memory ain't what oh, it used God. to be. Sometimes it needs motivating. Uh, tell me for free? I mean, <laughs> can't you just tell me, please? Sorry, youngster. I'm a traitor. And if something's got value, I can't give it away for nothing. Oh, man. That's kind of my motto at the, at the same time. Come on. Uh, Ain't that a coincidence? My mind's still hazy on the subject. Uh, Fine, 100 caps. Here you go. Well, I swore not to say a word, but an NCR deserter passed through some days ago and traded for supplies. According to him, the NCR has decided enough's enough and is going to send in a metal oh, truce God. to take back the prison any day now. All right. Betray Eddie by offering Lieutenant Hayes assistance? Dude, no, I'm not selling out my friends. That's horrible. Captain goes down with its ship. Oh, but I do need to get the new sheriff, though. Oh, man. Uh, let me go talk to uh, them so I can get the new sheriff. Because I'm still in their good graces, but hopefully not for long, dude. The NCR and their taxes? Ew. Taxes are the worst thing ever made. All right. Approaching the camp. Hey. Sergeant McGee. I don't need you. I need Hayes. Patrol in the Mojave. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? I'm Skinny Venus. Boxer, alcoholic, possibly addict, and sociopathic murderer. Uh... Prim's in dire need of some real law. We know Prim is a great strategic point, and we aren't blind to the needs of the town, but we're barely holding our own against the powder gangers. We don't have the guns or the personnel needed to carry out our mission, much less take on defending this town as well. Uh, what do you need to take over protecting the town? What we need more than anything is bodies. If we had just one more squad, we could easily install a sheriff and still handle our primary objective of protecting the interstate. If you'd like to see the NCR include protection of Prim and its duties, then you'll have to get some more troops. At night at Mojave Outpost may be able to. No, I want Meyer, Mayor, Mayors, Myers. What's his name? <laughs> I want him to be protecting Prim. Uh. Have you got? God, dude, everyone I talk to is like, go do this for me. Powder gangers never asked much of me. I offered help, they let me, and now I'm where I'm at. But they never forced me to do work for him until I met Eddie, but I was already liked by him and accepted. So, NCR needs to learn some respect. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna go talk to Eddie. You've got trouble. The NCR is planning a raid on this place soon. Sounds like they're already here. There's no way I'm letting them take me alive. Oh my god, they're There's here? no reason for you to stick around and help us. But feel free to kill a few of the bastards on your way out. Oh gosh. Here we go. Kings, queens, and everything in between. We're gonna be taking out some... Some nasty NCR... What, what are they? NCR Rangers? They're not Legion. I don't know, but... You'll never take me alive! 
Oh my gosh. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Let me get my magical stopwatch. Oh gosh. Uh, I'm gonna start injecting myself with some psycho. Uh, whiskey. They broke my helmet or my hat, so I'm getting a helmet. All right, uh, I'm needing them. You want to go? Oh, he's dead. They broke my helmet, man. Now I got to wear a trooper helmet. If I wear this, it'll disguise me as the NCR. So I can't really wear that right now. I mean, I could actually, but not in powder, powder ganger territory. They'll think I'm one of them, and I ain't one of those evil wanting taxes. I don't know. Bad guys. Well. Oh, there's more over here. Oh, there's so many. Have some dynamite! Catch! Ooh. Oh boy, I need some heals. Have some dynamite. I'm out of here. Uh, where, where's the rest of you? We gotta run. We gotta run. Okay. I'm still in danger. I think I accidentally hurt some of the powder gangers. I'm sorry. Leveled up. Oh, man, I thought it said vilified by the powder gangers. I would have been so sad. Vilified by the NCR. Okay. Who wants to side with the bad guys anyways? Uh, more explosives. Uh, let's do... Uh... I mean, sneak would be pretty fun, honestly. Just sneaking around and punching people. I don't know, but I need more unarmed, too. Ooh, lady killer. Cannibal. <laughs> uh, ooh. Cannibal would actually be really good, though. It's free heals whenever I kill stuff. But, I'm, I don't know if I'm going to have companions with me or not. Probably not, so. Now let's do Lady Killer. Free damage and unique dialogue. I'll do it. Alright. Okay, I'm hidden. I'm gonna go to Good Springs. I'm gonna <clears throat> sell a lot of stuff. I need to buy some more boxing gloves, more alcohol. What the heck? Easy Pete? Dude, he came back as a zombie. Also, Rip the Cranberries. Really good band. The zombie, really good song. Are you hiding? I won't make any trouble for the gang. Just let me keep my store and I'll cut you a little discount. Really? Dude, that's so nice. See, being good people, guys. Can do. Nice discount yes boxing tape and dynamite uh whiskey he did he actually did discount me stim packs used to be what 110 wow that's actually really good um i'm keeping the incinerator uh don't need you or you or you I might wear the NCR face wrap later. It's good to have one. Flamer fuel, that's what I need. Do you got flamer fuel? 
He does not. Pleasure doing business with you. Goodbye. Alright, well I got some stim packs back. That's good. I'm gonna go make some flamer ammo. Okay, so I need to get my science up. I guess we'll have to do that next time. I kind of want to get some points in intelligence, maybe. I don't know. I mean, intelligence has never hurt me, but just, uh... Or, intelligence has never really helped me with this build, so I don't know if I need to. But, I guess we are heading down here to the Mojave Outpost. We're vilified there. Why? Why? Oh, they're convicts. They're not powder gangers. They need to go down. Ooh. Oh, that was right on top of them. You want some? Oh, yes. Stealth bomber tactics. Gained karma, too. There's some guys around here. Can I sneak up and bump, bop them? Bop, bop, bop. Oh god, he found me. Getting knocked out. What is your problem? Square up. I'm hit. Ooh, I made her drop the weapon. Come on. Ooh, KO. Goodbye. Alright. Anyways, we ride. We're gonna try and get up to there. So, here we go. I'm actually gonna put on the uh, disguise right now. Alright. So, hopefully, fingers crossed, the uh, <clears throat> NCR will let me up there. That's something I loved about this Fallout as well, guys. This Fallout, it has ammo crafting, uh, buying weapon mods and stuff. I do like Fallout 4 because you can craft your own weapons and barrels and stuff. I think that's amazing. But being able to craft ammo at a reloading bench and collect casings, disguises, karma, I think all that stuff needs to get added. I think skill checks, too, need to be a bigger thing. The only thing they had was, I think, charisma. And there were a couple skill checks here and there, but they need to make them like way, way more prominent in the newest Fallout because it was so fun in this one. I also think settlement building, I love that. I'd spend more hours in settlement builder than anything in Fallout 4 and the uh, Automatron um, or Automatron. I don't know. It's that DLC where you make the robots. I love real steel, so being able to make your own robot, its arms, legs, and stuff, and weapons, I love that. They need to bring that back. I don't know. It's just, it was so amazing. And so, I think if you mix this with Fallout 4, you know, all this open space, being able to make, uh, settlements and have bandits attack it, that'd be the perfect Fallout game. I think I'd play that religiously. I haven't played Fallout 76 though. I swore I never would because after they did Elder Scrolls Online dirty, I'm like, I don't know. And I've heard some mixed reviews about Fallout 76. And so I'm like, as a Fallout fan, I'm not going to play that game. All they need to do is make it to where you can invite like three other buddies. That's all you need to do. I don't like this whole play with 80 people. So just thought, it, thought I'd have a little conversation about that. We Caravan, citizen, pilgrim, or... Caravan. Courier. Just need something for the logbook. You can tap. If you're looking for the commanding officer, he's... Also, if you need any gear checked... Hey, you didn't tell me your name. Oh, uh, nice. You must not be from around here. If so, 
Doesn't do to get too friendly. What do you mean? This isn't the Republic. Oddly enough, Legion's a little more forgiving about friendships. Out here, it's not as accepted. Not that I mind being friends. It's just being open about it in the outpost. Well, I have to work here. So is that a no? You don't want to be friends, or...? I would. Perhaps some other time. When my orders take me to Vegas, perhaps. I wish things were different, but it might take some time. If you need something repaired, let me know. I can sign the work order. As long as caps change hands, I can put them back in yours. Hey. I could use some help with my gear, actually. Let me sign off on the work order for you, then. Uh, let's see. God dang! That's so expensive. But give me my brass knuckles up. My boxing gloves up. I think that's it. I don't really need anything else. Goodbye. Yeah.